You're an engineer. Get the mind. Okay. <laughs> What's up, baggers? It's me, Goldie Blocks, and guys, we are celebrating the greeniest holiday, the most shamrockiest holiday ever. It is St. Patrick's Day, baby. Even if you're not Irish, it's a great time just to celebrate green. Like, if you love green, it's the perfect excuse to wear as much green as you can. That's what I did today. <laughs> If you can't tell, I kind of went along. It's time to hack your world. We have a leprechaun trap. I feel like every single time I like think of St. Patrick's Day, I think of capturing leprechauns. So I don't have an actual leprechaun to tr test this out. I wish, but I have a gnome family. Okay, so the first gnome is named Lucky because He's just named Lucky. Georgina, she is Georgina, uh, his little sister. And then this is the big mama, Georgia. So it's a great family. We're just gonna put Georgia right there because she won't fit in our trap. Um, love you the most. So let's pretend Georgina's a leprechaun. So she's just kind of doing a little Irish jig, you know, living her life, being like, what house am I gonna rob today? But then she sees this. She sees a white picket fence. She sees that rainbow, she sees that bucket of treasure. And she's like, I need that. So she's just chilling. She's like, oh, gotta steal it. Walks up. Oh, wow, a rainbow ladder. She walks up, she smells the beautiful moss that I landscaped. And then, wow, it's right here, so close. She can smell the treasure. She runs, she jumps even, does an Irish jig, then falls. For this DIY, I'll need two photo boxes, rainbow popsicle sticks, rainbow toothpicks, cotton balls, tissue paper, green cardstock, fake moss, a hole punch, rubber bands, a paper clip, a binder clip, a skewer. <sighs> Gonna be a mish. I need to write this down. Good, okay. A shim, mini fencing, a mini bucket, and leprechaun bait. First, decorate the inside of your box. I used green cardstock on the background and created a super cute rainbow with popsicle sticks and cotton. Next, cut the side off your base box and glue the two boxes together, like so. Cover up the seams with green cardstock and glue moss down to the floor so leprechauns don't get hurt. Next, make your lever. Hole punch the sides of the box. Then glue a binder clip to the bottom of the shim. Make the lever green so the leprechauns aren't suspicious. And stick the skewer through. Next, disguise your trap by building two platforms on the sides with tissue paper Build a little ladder out of toothpicks. Secure the treasure to the trap by dangling a bucket from the box using a rubber band and a paper clip. Finally, surround your trap with mini fences so the leprechauns have no chance of escaping. Leprechauns, beware! The Goldie Squad is coming for you. So I was thinking of making this green, but I really liked the floral pattern. And you know what? Leprechauns are looking like for traps. They know they're gonna be green or gold. This is kind of like a leprechaun camouflage. They're expecting the gold. They're expecting the green. They're expecting the shamrock. But you know what? We gave them a little house on the prairie and they love it and they're going for it. If they step on the moss, the very pretty greenery, it's tissue paper, so they can't outsmart you. Oh, that's probably a trap door. That's probably a lever and a simple machine. Oh no, what do I do? Jump on the grass? Oof, you're done. So uh, yeah, 
Georgina will fall anyways. Okay, so we're gonna take a break about talking about gnomes and leprechauns, and we're gonna get into simple machines. So basically what a simple machine is, it's a device that makes work easier by magnifying or changing force. There are six basic types of simple machines. There's a wedge, a wheel and axle, an inclined plane, a screw, a pulley, and a lever, which is what we have here. See, get it? It's a lever. So basically a lever is a long beam that sits on a fulcrum. Think of like a seesaw or this trap door. And that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. And yeah, have a happy St. Patrick's Day, hackers. Goldie Vlogs, signing off. <laughs>